Hello everybody and happy Monday. Welcome back. My name's Sasha Cooper and this is Quarantine Kids Storytime, of which I am the co-founder of the project. So, it's that time again. It's The Doll's House by Rumor Godden. Now, because we did this earlier on in the spring, obviously there will be no notifications saying that the episodes will be going out. So what that means is we do what's called a weekly check-in, which basically means that I get to tell you what chapters are coming up over the next week, as well as any changes to schedules that we need to know about. So, like I said on the weekly weekend roundup, we've come into a very interesting point in the tale in which March Payne has shown her true colours. Will she get back into the doll's house? And will Totty be able to get home? Keep watching to find out. Now, what is going to happen is we're going to do things slightly differently this week. So because it's Christmas coming up, what we're going to do is we're going to have a slight break in schedule. And the reason being is because it's Christmas Eve, believe it or not, on Thursday. So we're going to do three chapters of The Doll's House and then we're going to do special broadcast on Christmas Eve in order to bring you two, two gorgeous festive tales for Christmas Eve to ease you into the season. We're then also going to have Christmas Day off because I think we all need it. We all need it. Well, I certainly need it anyway. Anyway, because well, Alice and I especially, because we've been working really, really hard behind the scenes, trying to bring you as much content as we can to keep you entertained through these uncertain times. So coming up today, we will have chapter 13. On Tuesday, we will have chapter 14. And the final chapter of the week will be chapter 15 on Wednesday. Now, on Christmas Eve itself, which is Thursday, we have two very, very special tales coming up for you. Now, one of them, I'm going to put them at the end of this video for the simple reason that it's from HarperCollins children's books. And because of their open license, what tends to be the case is for protection purposes, they expect you to put it on unlisted. However, there is a special little playlist which will be at the end of this video so you can get access to that wonderful tale. Now, Annalisa Cantry is reading this tale and it will be her final festive seasonal tale. It's called Kipper's Christmas Eve and it's written by Mick Inkpen. Thank you once again to HarperCollins Children's Books for giving us the open license, as well as a few others out there, the open license to read these tales. It is much appreciated during these uncertain times, I can tell you. So, like I say, do check the end of the video for that particular tale. Now, we also have a brand spanking new Eric the Elf written and read by Philip Humphreys. And now this is a brand new exclusive tale for Quarantine Kids Storytime. And you never know, you might just catch it on his YouTube channel as well. So do check that out. Anyway, I was going to do a special video dedicated to Christmas Eve, um, especially to launch it. However, after giving it some thought, I thought, no, I can't wait till Christmas Eve to do another special video. Let's do it on a Monday when we do the weekly check-in. Now, because of these two special tales, we will not be doing a, another chapter of Totty until the following week because the following day, it's Christmas Day. And naturally, we want to give you all a break and I need to give myself a break because, well, between Alice and myself, we've literally been trying to upload content to entertain you all, uh, literally since these uh, uncertain times started. And we do hope that you're enjoying everything that is being put out there. Your support really is much appreciated. And of course, if you are enjoying the content, please do subscribe and please do click the little notifications bell down below as well so you don't miss out on the tales. So what will then happen is the next time you'll see me, it'll be in the weekly weekend roundup on Boxing Day itself. 
So, without any further ado, I will leave you to the wonderful world of Totty and the Doll's House by Rumor Godden. Take care, everybody. Have a wonderful Christmas and an amazing New Year. And as always, stay safe out there and I will see you on Boxing Day for the Weekly Weekend Roundup. Bye-bye!